I'm going to show you guys today exactly how it is I drive, how I get in and out of my car, and how I get my wheelchair in and out of my car. Pretty sassy. Pretty trendy. Pretty on the go. Pushing pretty. This is Pushing Pretty with Courtney and Lightning. So I've gotten a lot of questions asking, how do I drive? A lot of people don't know that people in wheelchairs can drive. When I first became a wheelchair user, I had no idea that I'd get to the point where I would be able to drive a car. But here we are. So I'm gonna show you guys today exactly how it is I drive, how I get in and out of my car, and how I get my wheelchair in and out of my car. So typically when I get ready to get into the car, I normally put my chair at an angle. That way when I'm getting transitioning from my chair to my car, I'm not rubbing my body against the wheels. And it just makes it a little bit easier for me to glide and get into the car. So just a little bit because I know once I get the wheels off of my chair, then the next step will be to put my actual base of my chair into the car. I want to make sure that I have enough room between myself and the steering wheel to get the base of the chair into the car, over me, over into the car. So, with that being said, I'm going to take the brakes off. I'm take off the first wheel. Should not slant the wheels a little bit so that the other wheel, once I put it on top of the one that's already in, uh, part of the wheel does not get stuck into the spokes of the wheel that's already in. So, let's see. All right, and the last part will be the base of my chair. Bring the back of it down, position it to where it's stable, and pull it off. So, the more you do this, the quicker you begin to get at doing it. So normally it takes me about at least a minute or so, depending on how much video I have on the day and just how fast I'm going. So now that you know how I get in my car and how I get my chair in my car, let me show you exactly how it is I drive my car. So this is my hand control um, and it is connected to the gas and brake. When I want to brake, I grab it and I go in in the brake, I come back up so that I'm not in two both gears, and I go down for the gas. So now that I've showed you how my hand controls work, let me take you on a little journey. But before I do that, 
let me just explain to you what this little thing here is. This is a called a steering knob. With me being a quadriplegic, I have a little bit of trouble with the muscles in my hands. So this just gives me a better grip on the steering wheel when I'm turning. So that being said, let's go. So now that I've arrived to my location, let me show you how I get my chair out. So I'm going to put my seat back in the neck. This time I'm going to get a, the base of the car out, the base of the chair out first. So now you've seen exactly how I drive, how I get in and out of my car, and how my hand controls work. Thank you so much for watching my channel. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you. Mm -hmm.